Well, hello. I just downloaded update uh, 2021.44.6 last night, and it comes with a couple of really neat things that I will particularly enjoy. One is the new auto park feature, and the second is the, the driver profile improvements. And so I'm gonna go through each of these today and show you how they work. First, I'm going to talk about the auto park, which I, as I said, I, I particularly appreciate this because the, the improvement is that it will now park based on lines, the painted markings and road edges. And the reason why I really like that is because before you had to pick a parking spot that was between two parked cars and forgive me but i i would always avoid that you know i would i typically pick a spot far away from other parked cars so that's the opposite of what i would look for so i never used the parking feature it was like it didn't even have one because i never noticed it but now it works very well. I've, I've tested that uh, feature this morning and it works very well. So it spots a parking spot based on the lines that, you know, a spot that's available. And then you'll notice it up on this head up display. Uh, this is a Model X, so it has a head up display and uh, the large touch screen. So it'll show you here. And then if you throw it into reverse, then it will show you down here and, and and then you just have to press start and you're off so i'll show you how that works right now i'm just going to drive a little bit drive uh, okay there it'll show you a parking spot so i'm going to test this out right now um, you go into reverse and then down here in the main screen it shows you the spot and offers you this button to start. And then you just take your foot off the parking brake. It actually put on that directional signal, not me. Um, and let's see how it uh, how it does. It's not my hands, not my hands. car driving by there doesn't seem to bother it not me my hands are over here my other hands holding the camera I thought I would give this parking spot meters, turn right onto your a street. test because you can see how the Sun is is kind of glaring at us from behind there I, I wondered whether that might interfere with with it but uh, it didn't let's take a look at the parking job all right so there's that Sun I was talking about I really wondered whether that glare might interfere but it didn't well that Is really good that is really good that's that's better than I do because I gotta tell you for whatever reason even now when I park this myself I always find I want once I get out of the car I want to pull it forward you know I'm I'm too far back generally like a couple of feet so that's a great job. Very impressive. Really easy to use. Well done, Tesla. Now the other added feature with update 2021.44.6 is this driver profiles improvements. And uh, this is again something that is really handy for me because I've retired recently and my my profile still has my my work 
um, as as being, you know, where I used to work. Um, everybody knows I used to work at Holy Trinity School, worked there for a very long time, uh, but I've retired now. So interestingly enough, my, my wife also works at that school. So depending on whether she was using the car or not, she might want to have that workplace under her profile. So I hadn't changed it because I wanted to leave it there in case my wife happened to use this vehicle. Um, but now I can, so that's great. So uh, what you do is under your profile, you, you know, I've got my profile here. You go to navigate somewhere and then you're going to long press, you're gonna hold this and then up pops the address. And so I'm just gonna clear that. Now you can see that um, under my work address, it's available to be set and it's just a blank place. And you can, you can pick from a variety of favorite addresses. And I know what I'm gonna pick. I'm not gonna enter it right now, but I'm gonna pick for my work address um, the sports complex where my son plays hockey, where he has hockey practices, where I play hockey, where I work out, and just I think that'll be a fun kind of address to have for my work address in the car because I go there almost every day. All right, so that is how you would uh, change your, your work address and customize it to different profiles. So remember the key is to hold that, you know, that button long hold and then it, it pops up a place where you can enter your address or pick it from your favorites. Hey, if you like this video, don't forget to click that like button and uh, leave me a comment if you'd like. I'd love to hear from you. Don't forget to subscribe so you don't miss anything going forward.